Hi, Brian Novak, Portfolio Manager with Acer and Investment Management. Thanks for joining us today. I want to talk a little bit about Q3 and some of the numbers we saw heading through the quarter. August was a bit of a malaise, a bit concerning as far as looking at the growth picture, but as we moved into September, major indicators like the ISM manufacturing and ISM non-manufacturing both indicated a little bit of a rebound in the economy, giving us a little bit of reason to be hopeful moving into the fourth quarter. ISM manufacturing, the, the manufacturing side of the economy, posted a, a good result uh, in contrast to the previous two months, which gave people a little bit of a hope that the manufacturing industrial side of the economy might be rebounding. The service side, the larger portion of the economy, actually had a strong rebound, much more than was expected, gave us a lot of reasons to be hopeful for what the consumer is seeing heading into the fourth quarter. Now, as we stand about a week away from the first look on GDP for Q3, it's looking to be about 2.5%. Uh, based on those figures, we might expect it to be right around there. That's a bit higher than what was expected halfway through the third quarter, but that's going to be a good springboard going into the fourth quarter uh, for growth moving into the end of the year. Moving outside the borders, Eurozone PMI actually showed a bit of a bid as well, congruent with what we saw on the U.S. side, giving hope that maybe we might be seeing a rebound on the international side as well. One of the topics on everyone's mind is what the Fed's going to do as we head to the end of the year. With the growth picture picking up at the end of the third quarter, as we move into the fourth quarter, it looks like the Fed's on target for a rate hike in December. To be sure, tenure has hit a level we haven't seen in many months, indicating that traders believe that this is going to happen at the end of the year. To find out more about how Aster can provide you with portfolio solutions, please visit our website at www.asterim.com.